Uh, I'm publishing a video about V-Ray Render. There is a feature called Denoising and I will be going to use this. I'm checking my render. It still has some noise but it is, it is going to look very good. To save a uh, time, uh, how to use this I will show you because it's important to use this because you are going to render and you will, without this you will get lots of noise. Okay, let's get started. First of all, I was setting up everything. I got light, size multiplier, maybe I will uh, use that value is the proper one. You have to use sky texture. I already copied V-Ray Sky. When you drag, when you drag my mouse button, vice versa, you will you will have options. I used intensity multiplier value like this. I don't know uh, if you increase will be too right. I just wonder if I can change this little bit. Oh, will be little bit too dark. No, oh, let's leave these settings. Okay, how we can use a V-Ray organizer? Let's get back to settings. Because before you use this in common, we have to we have to have assigned render material production and active shade. Then render elements. We go to add options. We already added the noise. This is what we have to add. I already added uh, in advanced uh, options. You have to deselect hardware acceleration, otherwise your image will be uh, rendered in black. This will help you to fix this issue when you untick this. Okay, update. Now I will be ready to render. Also consider option if you want to use custom settings, use studio setup. If you want a V-Ray to render your current settings, create your own preset. Uh, V-Ray denoising, denoising. Ah. Uh, denoiser. Reset, press reset free. If you want your presets, all of them to copy to catalog, to one of the catalog, go to my documents, 3ds Max. So, mom, tell me if you Render presets. Sorry, one member of my family was disturbing me. Okay, copy from documents. Because you will have in your separate folder. I have to copy all of them. Because you do not have to set render again. Because you will have your all settings in folder here. And to main folder. Program files. Autodesk. 3ds Max 2018. Render presets. Because you cannot save to this catalog, it is not possible. You have to, you have to take ownership. Probably, I didn't do that yet. And then you will be able to save your render presets to that catalog. Okay. Now uh, what I do, I have to save again. I already saved. Uh, I have to save uh, here. Also, consider this. When you want to save uh, a render denoiser uh, uh, image, call this. V-Ray denoising 2. This is to do with this 
Gang noise, gang, gang, gang noise there. Because before I didn't check this, it was on. When this is on, it shouldn't be because otherwise your image will be black. Okay, let's get started now. If you do not remember where your file will be saved, um, what you can do, sort by date, again, sort by date. No, oh, it didn't come up yet. Oh yes, it is a little bit slower, I think, because I use the high value. Okay, go. okay, my friends, hopefully this will work. I have to wait when this render finish. It looks a little bit better because I use the preset strong. Actually I can see the difference of my 3D house. But another image will come up when this image is going to be completed. I have to compare this original image to that one which will be rendered. takes some time. It's not too bad because I have chosen progressive rendering which is fast enough. Okay, my fault again. It's not the this, this is all the image. Oh no, I did, I, what I did, this is Group by yeah, I don't want to use group. I have to use sort by date. This is what I needed. I don't remember what was the name of file. Oh, very denoising too. Mm. Yes, yes, this is what I was looking for. Maybe sort, sort by name. This must be one of them. I guess we'll I will save to the desktop. This hmm very denizing too. Hmm, the name shouldn't be like this. It messes up everything. I 
I'm too lazy to set this up properly. Okay, let's check again. Because I already used the custom settings, but I didn't remember. This folder I don't need. Okay, sort. Sort by date. to wait I used to have black image why I have duplicate images now oh, this is old what about this oh this is newer I can see the difference but what about this ah house name of file no oh, it didn't come up yet oh definitely looks better this is actually great feature I have, I can see I have less noise than what I had before. But uh, my program works in the background. Oh, this thing really works. Before I used the, v uh, before I used V-Ray Genoiser, I had lots of noise. Believe me, without the, this feature, your render time will take incredibly long time. My house, I will call this. I will check if we create a copy. Yes, I got copy of this. Hmm. Why this has lots of noise? What about this? Oh this is actually modif this is actually changed. I can still see little bit of noise but it looks not too bad. Could be better. I think that's it. If if you consider to change settings, you can still use. Hmm. This is actually interesting. Okay. That's it.